Okay, so I want to show you uh, how to use the white balance gray reference card uh, together with these retractors in a, in a digital camera in the mouth of our patient. Okay, so um, the patient is here um, to have his teeth photographed and we use these sort of retractors which are readily available. They're not very expensive and um, they're, they're quite good. They usually have you know, the right size for you know, adult size. And what you do is um, you place the retractors in the mouth, not like this, but first you place them like that. Uh, put them in like this and then like, like that and same thing here. And then you get the patient to hold them for you. And then, and then, so this is a typical, a typical thing that patients do is that they hold the retractor like that and this is actually going to interfere with your flesh. So what you want them to do is you want them to move the hands backwards and hold them by the handle. And then ideally, instead of holding it like that, turn the hand around and hold it the other way around, like this, so that the fingers are out of the picture. And then you tell them to close and then pull the retractors back and up towards the ears, like that and then it's perfectly retracted. Okay, so then you tell the patient to move the mandible forward so that it is in an edge-to-edge -edge position with the maxilla, and you place the white balance gray reference card in the middle so that its midline aligns with the vertical midline of the patient, like that. Okay, so then um, for the photography, I have my, my camera here, my digital DSLR camera here. Um, you can take the photo, of course, with a ring flash, or you can, you can do that with a bracket. Um, for reflected photography, we have developed this bracket here. This is called the axis bracket, um, which is a fixed bracket, meaning that you can't adjust it. And it produces a 45 to zero degree illumination, which is ideal for reflected photography. And then you should hold the camera so that the optical axis of the camera is perpendicular to the horizontal plane of the white balance gray reference card. And you should be shooting in the manual mode with an exposure time of 125th of a second and an aperture of 22. And you should choose the lowest ISO possible, which typically is ISO 100. You should also set your image quality to RAW. So when you photograph with polarized, you have to consider that the polarized attenuates the, the amount of light that comes out of the flash. So for that purpose, it's best to set your flash to the manual mode and choose the maximum output, which is 1-1. One, one. Okay, so now this is perfectly retracted and the only thing that we have to do is we have to tell the patient to lower his head very slightly so you get the perfect angle. And again, move the mandible forward into an edge-to-edge -edge position. And then you hold the gray reference card in the picture and take the shot.